a full body scanner being demonstrated at Amsterdam Schiphol Airport. It's this technology that the Netherlands believes could have stopped Umar Farouk al Mutalab from passing through here unchallenged. The Dutch interior minister said a major catastrophe had been averted, but she also told Al Jazeera her country had had no reason to suspect the passenger. The suspect is not known in our files here in the Netherlands. Uh, he was known, as we understood, uh, in the files uh, of the United States and what had happened there and why he is not um, uh, excluded from getting a visa for the United States, I don't know. Do you think that there was a failure of communication? No, there's no failure of communication because it's not customary that uh, the United States uh, gives us information uh, about people who are on their lists. This is the kind of machine that Omar Farouk Abdul Muttalab would have gone through, a standard metal detector which picks up the microphone I'm using, for example, but not the kind of explosives that he was carrying, and so he didn't set off any alarms. The Netherlands is now planning to introduce full body scanners for people traveling to the United States. There are 15 such machines already in place, but they're used on a voluntary basis and only for flights within Europe. Schiphol have had these units in place under test for the last 18 months. Now this is part of the enhancement program for future uh, standard common rules. But um, the application of this type of technology for every passenger is operationally impractical. New technology means the body image is analysed by computer, getting round privacy concerns. Most people Al Jazeera spoke to said they thought the new scanners were a good idea. Well, as long as it's anonymous, I don't think it's a problem. No, I actually think it's a good idea. I think it's for our safety. I wouldn't have a problem with it as long as it doesn't cause any further time delays. As it is, you go through quite a number of security checks here anyways. Dutch authorities hope the European Parliament will change its ban on the general use of the scanners. For now, Schiphol continues to trial the new scanners in the belief they could play a crucial part in the fight against terrorism. Nadine Barber, Al Jazeera, Amsterdam.